Hi, prospective student. Welcome to Alumni Hall, the greatest men's dorm on campus. Uh, it's built in 1931, so it's got so much rich history and tradition, uh, but it's finally been renovated, and this is actually a, basically a brand new building this year. Um, before we go in, though, and start the tour, I just want to show you around where the dorm actually is on campus. So if you look here, we have South Quad and God Quad that way, so the dome is that way. Um, we're really close to both South Dining Hall and DeBartolo Hall, which is where um, a lot of classrooms will be. And also right here is Main Circle, which is one of the best places to basically, if you need to get a car ride somewhere or an Uber, um, this is where you can ask people to pick you up. And it is literally right next to our dorm. So it is a great location. We call ourselves the center of the universe for that very reason. But now let's head inside and take a look at this brand new building. How's it going, Pat? How's it going, Josh? How's it going, Mike? What up, Josh? All right, so this here is our little parlor area where you can hang out. It's air conditioned, it's really nice. Brand new little waiting area right by the door, so if you're waiting for your car or something, chill it here. Let's actually head inside. So this right here is one tally, the best hallway in Alumni Hall. As you can see, all of our wiffle ball gear and golf clubs are outside of our rooms because whenever we're not busy, we love to find something to do outside. <laughs> this is the main hallway. It includes the new addition, the door in the middle. So we have an uh, air conditioned area right next to the South Quad entrance. And this is where everyone's hanging out, the main hallway. A lot of action down here. Absolutely great area to feed them to both the brand new lounges, which we just got installed this year. Um, they've completely redid the floor plan, and all the lounges are really nice. So we'll show you some of the lounges. Here's what we like to call the dog park. So we got a new TV, new furniture, this whole area is air conditioned. And a full kitchen area around this corner. Also a broken ping pong table. <laughs> <laughs> Which I'll leave next to. <laughs> Around the corner here, you'll find the area for all the mailboxes for each student, as well as two study lounges. And oh look, it's a freshman. <laughs> what up, JT? How's it going? Hi, Josh, doing good. How's your experience been in alumni hall so far as the first year? It's 100% the best hall on campus. No question. We'd love to hear. I concur. Oh, why is there a chess board there, Mike? Chess tournament going on right now. We love hanging out here, having some activities going on in the lounge, and if anyone ever, ever wants to play a chess game, it's there for them to use. Yep, whatever you're into, we're here for. And here we have our rector's room. If you're walking around, you're sure to see Jay walking dorm dog Toff, especially yeah. at night. She loves going on night walks. Yep, she's a little shih tzu, really adorable. And our dorm mascot is the dogs, so it is fitting that we have one in our very own hall. But yeah, so again, here are some lounges. Here's a printer, if you need to use that. And we'll go ahead and show you the chapel, which is actually original. Um, it was not redone. It's really nice space. So yeah, it's really beautiful. We'll come in here for dog mass every Sunday at 9 p.m which is when the dorm comes together and invites friends as well uh, to worship and have some communion together. And it's an awesome, quiet, holy space. So right here are the South Quad doors and you'll find the super luscious and expansive South Quad right out there. There's tons of activities that we love to do. What are some of your guys' favorite activities to do? If you like to play wiffle ball, kick a soccer ball, throw a football, even just take out a chair and have a quad sit, South Quad's the perfect place. That's what I would say. Quad sits are the best. Anytime it's sunny, get some guys out there to hang out with them. Yep, we will be on South Quad. All right, let's head upstairs. All right, so this is the second floor. Uh, this is the two main hallway. Right down here, we have two America, which is called that for the big American flag hanging on the wall there. We do a flag raising ceremony for that every year. And here's one of our brand new study lounges. It's a smaller one, but you can find these on every single floor. And here we have our section lounge, which is air conditioned, as is the study lounge. Hi, Buzz. How's it going? Good. How are you, Josh? How do you feel about alumni hall? No, I just love it here. Two of my greatest friends here, PT and Mike. 
and my third best friend Josh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, anyways, we have brand new foot in here. And uh, there's a fridge as well. That nice maker, didn't have that last year. Yep, we did not have ice. <laughs> cool new one. We used to have to go to the basement anytime we wanted ice. Yep. So, dark times. We don't stop the time. That really spoiled us, but now we're back with all this nice stuff. So, yeah, this is a nice area to hang out. There's a Wii as well, so, it's always a good time. It was. We'll keep going down to the main hallway. Show you guys into some uh, rooms that you might be living in. So this right here would be the example of a quad. Um, and this would be like the common room, and on the side you'd have two pebbles. This is an example of the uh, double that you might find. And yeah, each quad has three rooms, so two of these doubles and one common room. And then I'll show you guys my single, which is right down to the right. So right here is my room. You can take a look inside. This is an example of one of the very spacious and peaceful singles you'll find in our dorm. Um, but it's nice because anytime you want people, they're right outside the hallway, so. Sometimes we'll spend hours just chatting in the hallway and just hanging out, so. Everyone's doors are usually unlocked or open, and we're just there for each other, and it's a great community, so. All right, let's keep moving over this way. Here. Oh, that's a look inside the room of one of our priests and residences. Uh, we have two, we have Father Dan and Father Jerry. They're both wonderful people. Um, right here we have the two tally hallway. All right guys, so now we're on the third floor. And just to orient you, this is one tally, or sorry, three tally. And right down to the left, you have three main. And then this little section right here is three essay. We have names for each of our sections, which you'll learn once you're here. And right in this little corner, we have our brand new elevator, which we did not have before, so. And this is our brand new elevator. We did not have it before the renovation. It was really tough, especially on moving day get your stuff up here, mm -hmm. but now in a couple quick trips, you're all moved in. Yep. And whenever freshmen are moving in, we have an entire crew for the welcome to get in, who will be helping you guys move in all of your stuff without any trouble. So don't worry about bringing a lot of heavy stuff because we got you guys. Now we'll head down three main and head up the stairs to see uh, the fourth floor area. And also note, there are two bathrooms on every floor. Um, there'll be one in the tally hallway and one in the chally hallway, which is directly parallel to this one. Okay, here we have Father Jerry's room. Uh, every Sunday before Mass, he bakes cookies for us, and we come in here and chat with him. It's a great time. And his new cookies are awesome. New flavor every week. They're so good. Yeah. My favorite's the red velvet. I, I actually agree. The red velvet is so good. So yeah, so this is the three main hallway, and we'll go up the main stairs here. Hey, Josh. Hi, Josh. John, how are you today? I'm alright. Got good. a lot of stuff done. Good to hear. Alright, so we'll head up the main stairs here. How's it going, Joey? How are you? Doing good, how are you good? So, Joey, how's your freshman year experience at Alumni Hall then? It's going good, I love the community here. Awesome. Good year. So this here is the study lounge on the fourth floor. It's also been renovated. Um, and it is air conditioned, so if you really need to do some footwork, it's a great place to come. And with the addition of all the study lounges on every floor, this is a great place if you really need a private spot to do your homework, if you've got a really big essay to do, come up here. Mm -hmm. It's super quiet, very peaceful. Everyone else up here will also be here. So, you know, we'll be able to focus. Because everyone else in the dorm, we got so much going on all the time. It's nice to come up here and have a little bit of quiet time. Now we'll head back downstairs and we will show you guys what's in the basement, which has a bunch of new stuff in it, including the laundry in the gym. So now we're here in the basement. I'll show you guys around. So all this was also brand new, uh, brand new renovated, remodeled, you name it. We have a lot of stuff down here, um, starting with food sales over here. So right behind you we have dog pizza. This is where some alumni residents make pizza for everyone else and sell it. It's a great uh, place to go once the dining halls are closed. So come down and get some pizza bagels. If you ever need a late night snack, dog pizza's open when the other places aren't. It's a great pizza, great place. Really tasty. And uh, we have our washers here. 
and our dryer is on the side there. Um, but the laundry is completely free to use, just like everywhere else on campus, and so make sure you're doing your laundry regularly. Now we're going to go to the gym, which is unfortunately not yet open because uh, they're shipping some brand new equipment. But when it gets here, it'll be awesome. When you get here, it'll be here. Mm -hmm. And can't wait for the gym to open up. We didn't have really anything in, uh, before it was renovated. Now we got a whole new equipment, a whole new set. Should be really nice. Looking forward to it. It's going to be awesome when it gets here. So this is our courtyard. We have a lot of activities out here. Uh, we recently had a cookout with Pascarella East. They're our sister dorm. Shout out to Pyros. And we had lots of hot dogs, lots of hamburgers, lots of water balloons. And shout out to the Grill Master Fitz. Every year, Dorm has a Grill Master. It's their responsibility to have all the goods ready for those cookouts. We've got the grills here. It's a great place to hang out, even when there's nothing going on. It's a nice place. Lots of trees. Very beautiful. Mm -hmm. And it's a little bit more secluded, so it's like really peaceful. And we have lots of, again, like you mentioned, uh, inner hall events as well with other dorms. And that area is where the brand new section lines that was added on, which we showed you earlier. Um, this year, and that path is also brand new. That's up the landscaping, and again, the architecture of Alumni Hall is truly beautiful. So, now we're gonna head out um, to South Co op for the end of our tour. So, yeah, this is the beautiful South Co op, one of the biggest quads on any college campus. Um, it's just a wonderful space, so much green, it's just a really beautiful place to spend at any time of the day. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for joining us on this tour. Alumni Hall is one of the most amazing group of men you'll find ever anywhere in the world they're all here for each other and we're like a truly wonderful brotherhood and now we finally have a nice building to match our beautiful community so yeah thank you guys so much for joining us go irish go dogs go dogs go